Hello YouTube, this is Kaito JR here, and I am here just to let you all know that Season 4 of the Attack on Titan anime is almost here. It's almost upon us. We have just three more weeks, everybody. I looked this up on the Attack on Titan wiki on Twitter, and yep, three more weeks. I even had this on my calendar too, so I knew kind of either way, but yep, that's just what I wanted to notify to all of you, just in case you don't remember. But if you are a huge Attack on Titan fan, or just a fan in general really, you should already know about this, yeah. Three more weeks, Attack on Titan Season 4 is almost here, the final season of Attack on Titan. Yeah, this is the most biggest one because it's the last one. There won't be any more Attack on Titan after Season 4, unfortunately. I think it might have 22 episodes, like, like for the first part 11 and second part 11 as well, so you can make 22. They should probably make it a little bit more smaller so, you can, so they can write this a little bit more tighter so they, can, they don't have to add any filler into it. Because we want 100% content on the on the anime from the manga. That's what we all want and need as well. And as I think we're going to kick off at Fort Slava in Season 4, Episode 1. Yeah, yeah the first episode of Season 4, that's what we're going to kick off at. We're going to be seeing Falco, just like how we saw in the trailer for Season 4. We're going to see Falco and Fort Slava just like laying down on the floor, watching a bird or some sort of hawk or whatever, and like fly, just flying on the sky. And he's like, fly away. It's too dangerous here. Yeah, he just says stuff like that. If you read the manga, you know what he says. Yeah, and then Coles, he runs up to his little brother. Yeah, we're going to see that at the first episode of season four. We're definitely going to see that. And he's going to get Falco out of there. And yeah, you know what happens after that. And yes, I will be reviewing every single episode of season four, starting with episode one, which it will come out in December 7th, 2020, first in Japan. Then it will be sent here to on YouTube and probably on Funimation as well and then Crunchyroll. But I think Funimation will probably dub this. It might take some time for like for this like you know season four to be dubbed because all the other English voice actors for the dubbing of most anime are all busy right now with Bryce Pappenbrook and all that sort of stuff. All those actors, yeah, yeah, they're all busy with their own like voice acting, with other stuff like with you know with Bryce because yeah Bryce Pappenbrook he voices Kirito and all those other characters like that and yeah so he's busy with that and uh, well yeah. That's just why I want to just tell all of you that season four is almost here. The hype is on. We're gonna see it. It's gonna be really exciting, and I can't wait to start reviewing the first episode of season four of the anime. I'm not used to. I usually just review manga chapters. I don't really review anime all that much, but I'm gonna start it. But I mean, it, it shouldn't be that hard. I mean, I watch a lot of anime, so I should be fine with this. I mean, it's not gonna be difficult at all. Really, isn't? But yeah, yeah, just. Three more weeks, I'm gonna start my first review for season four, episode one of the Attack on Titan anime. So yeah, I'll see you all next time when that happens. But yeah, but yeah, that's it for the video, everybody. Thanks for watching and bye.